Boom, we sure did in part because McCoy may still be trying to find that form he showed in 2013 when he led the league in rushing yards, but it's clear he's still the focus of every opposing defense the Eagles face and with good reason to get a better sense of McCoy's speed and strength. We chose a bit of an unorthodox approach in this piece from ESPN Sports Science. To find out what makes last season's leading rusher so dynamic, we brought Philadelphia's LaShawn McCoy into the ESPN Sports Science Lab. During our array of running back tests, McCoy showed off an impressive combination of explosion and agility. On our Game Changer test, he alters his direction three times in just 1.3 seconds before executing a spin move at a peak angle of velocity of 560 degrees per second. That's faster than a professional cyclist typically pedals during the Tour de France. There, it ain't easy though. I gotta really go through it. Ah. We measured McCoy's power and found that while dragging a heavy bag 10 yards, he generates an average of about 1,500 watts of power, enough to power an average American household for the duration of the test. <laughs> this explosive power is especially key in Chip Kelly's offense, which is designed to create space that McCoy must get through quickly. Coach Kelly. Oh, man, yeah. Talk to me about his unique approach to the game. Coach Kelly feels like it just seems that on defense, they cheat. You know, they only cover a certain amount of the field. But we're, we're, we're all about speed and quickness. He finds ways to spread the field and, and gives us the opportunities to go one-on-one. -on -one. To challenge McCoy's ability to get through lanes, we brought in 700 pounds of pure sumo. These some real big guys right here. With the sumos lined up just three yards apart, McCoy will have to get skinny and squeeze through them before they collide. And three, two, one, go. Who wakes up? Nice. By the time McCoy gets to the line of scrimmage in just four strides, he's already at 15 miles per hour. This allows him to shoot through the hole and miss getting squished by 16 hundredths of a second. And because of his incredible burst of speed, by the time the hole closes, he's already beyond the sumos by four feet. And if the hole closes too soon, McCoy has shown he still has the ability to power through. Last season, despite being 15 pounds lighter than the average running back, McCoy was second in the NFL in broken tackles. For ESPN Sports Science, I'm John Brinkus.